News this morning about the aftermath of police killing an unarmed man in Indianapolis last summer. The mayor, the police chief, and Aaron Bailey's family all have new comments. Drew Blair joins us live at police headquarters with the reaction. Drew. Well, Scott, just about everyone who has had a say on this issue has expanded their thoughts on the work that takes place inside this building and on the streets of Indianapolis. Aaron Bailey's family is calling for change to police training, while others like the mayor and the police union are debating changes to the mayor board process. That's what cleared two officers in Bailey's death. He was unarmed when he was shot and killed following a police chase last year. The mayor repeated to News 8 yesterday that he was frustrated that the recommendation to fire the officers made by the chief of police was not upheld. The Fraternal Order of Police says nothing needs to be changed regarding the board. Instead, the union says it's launching a public service campaign to educate people about the do's and don'ts during interactions with police. It also plans to approach state lawmakers about encouraging the BMV to incorporate training too. Our overall theme for these various collaborative discussions and educational opportunities must focus, focus on the mantra of comply now, complain later. Aaron Bailey's daughter, Erica, does not agree with that approach. She says police should focus on themselves when it comes to training, not the community. You will hear her reaction still ahead on Daybreak coming up at 7 o'clock. Also, our coverage continues right now online at wishtv.com. You can hear from the Bailey family, their attorney, as well as the mayor. Scott and Lauren. Drew Blair, thank you.